The uh, Bellevue community is processing the loss of a 13-year-old child gunned down at Red Caboose Park. Peyton Kennedy's live at that park and spoke with the district council member there about safety in the area. And Neil, this tragedy is one of at least two other juvenile involved shootings in the area that have happened so far this year. One of them happening in a shopping center, another in a church parking lot, and now here at a metro park. And the Metro Nashville Police Department says that on Wednesday night, just before 8 p.m., a fight broke out in this park, and 13 year old Aiden Hayes was shot multiple times. His 16 year old sister was also hit in the gunfire. The family shared these photos with us. They say Aiden had just graduated from Bellevue Middle School, which is right next door. He was pronounced dead at VUMC. His sister is recovering. Metro Police are charging 15-year-old DeAnthony Osasifo with criminal homicide and attempted criminal homicide in the shooting. He, as well as the 16-year-old victim, both attended James Lawson High School this past year. I spoke with the Metro Council member for the area about this incident. She says, of course, her heart is just aching over this. Relatively, though, and looking at the yearly numbers, she ensures that this is still a safe community and there are many ways they can step up to support young Bellevue families. There are a lot of things that have to happen. One of the things that I shared with a group this morning was that the one thing that I dread is summertime. And it's because you've got kids with nothing else to do and without focus and without engagement and we've got to find support for them. We've got to find support for everybody all year long. Um, but this is just not even June 1st. And so what's the rest of the summer going to look like? We've got to make sure that there's a short term and a long term fix. Nashville Mayor Freddie O'Connell did share in his statement that the city is working to expand opportunities for the area's youth. We're meeting with the mayor later this morning. We'll ask him for more details on that statement, as well as for comment on the discovery that Metro Parks does not have a camera here at Red Caboose. We'll bring you those details on News 2 at 11. Live in Bellevue, Peyton Kennedy, News 2. All right, we'll bring you the very latest and more reaction to this. And as you mentioned, we'll have an update from the mayor at 11 o'clock. Uh, you can also find these updates posted to WKRN.com.